Hello and welcome to Open Boosters. We have not opened any Strixhaven. So let's take care of that right now. All right, it's been a while. Summer is always that hard time of year to actually get things done, get videos up on Open Boosters. We've seen it every year, but here we go. All right, we got Strixhaven Collector Booster Packs. Da, da, da. I actually don't mind Strixhaven. I think it's pretty good. All right, here we go. Strixhaven, Fixhaven. <laughs> da, da, da. So, how's everybody doing today? Hope y'all are doing good. All right, so we got our combat professor here. Relic Sloth. Pledge Mage with a room. Reckless Amplus, Ampla, Amplamancer, Professor's Warning, all right, we got our Master, Master uh, Seamstress, Reconstruct History, all right, Academic Probation, our first Mythic, Crackle with Power, And then we have our scholarship sponsor, followed by a lore mage, followed by something I don't know. <laughs> oh, we have opened this before. Oh man, I forgot. Yes, I remember getting the foreign ones and not realizing what I had. All right, so we have opened this before. My apologies. Inquisition uh, of Keselik's, Keselik. Defiant Strike. That there, that there. Put the foreign ones up here. I guess they have more, a little more value. Not quite sure about that. A little bit more room on the camera. Defiant Strike. Compulsive Research. Let's see, I should put this slide you here, slide you here. I'll make it with you here. And then an elemental. But we have opened it for completely forgot. But now I remember, so there you go. All right, so let's just take these over here. All right, got our first day of class. I love the learn ability. I think I remember saying that a lot last time because I like the learn and the lessons. We got our lesson over here, All right? Well, but there's a spell that creates that token. Sorry, um, a lesson spell. I uh, know. Uh, yeah, let's uh, see, that's learn. Yeah, lesson spell. All right, that's why my brain is saying that uh, I can do that. And I, I don't mind this bird. This bird's actually pretty good if you need to get rid of something out of the graveyard. It's a cheap casting cost. Just draw a card there, reach Clowny. I gotta start playing Arena again for a while. Cause you know, when you don't play for a while, everything goes out the window. And it's been a little bit. Ah, summer, kills my time. All right, we have a treasure token, and then we have our eye twitch, which, you know, he's a black one, and it gets you an extra card, so, when he dies. <laughs> so, I actually like it. It's not that bad. Sacrifice it, and then maybe you can put it back on the table with that uh, champion that actually puts these uh, guys back on the board. It's not bad. Whoops, wrong place. All right. And then we have our teachings of, I haven't played with this one yet because i don't have them on arena all right but i will at some point i'm sure and then we have our scroll wielder and then technique just put it there and we have another mythic students advocate not too into white but you know you can cast a instant or sorcery spell from your graveyard this turn that spell doesn't target a creature you control it cost eight so make sure it targets one of your stuff, I guess. Mm, we'll just put it right here, just so it's on the board. Negate. I do not know. Two green and two. Not sure. Two white. That's a beautiful artwork foil. Right there. That's awesome looking. I like that one. Put this off to the side. Mm -hmm. 
We're in trouble. We're running out of room. So I like that artwork. All right. Slidey, slidey. There we go. That's a good looking art. That's a good looking card. For sure. All right. We are full art, full, full art foil. Sparring region in the spirit. He's not as good. <laughs> All right, Battle Seer, Heated Debate, Pilgrim of Ages, Fanatic, Lore, uh, Campus, Lore's Hold, Guide, Rip Apart, Fractal Summoning, which is actually a great card if you haven't played it yet. Um, theorist, and then performer. Just gonna put you on the floor. Devastating mastery. I have no idea. Tainted pact. There we go. Put you over. I'll just put you over here since you're non-foil. But you are a mythic. But. Then we have duress. So foil version. Then we have Strict Saving Stadium. I've not played with this. It's interesting though. Because if you have 10 or more and it's a land, people don't usually. Um... Oh, it's an artifact. Never mind. It's not a land. Has anyone ever played with this and won? I might have to try it. I know I have one, but it, so that's not going to be really effective. It's only 3D on the board. So if it deals combat to me, then it removes a point. But if you get a bunch of like little tiny things and you go whoosh, and fill it up with points, Kind of like the poison counters, except they go away. I don't know. It's interesting. I like it. I gotta play with it though. I'm sure that somebody out there has a stadium deck. That just makes sense to me that you would try. Alright, make your mark. This is actually a good card too. Just because of the learn ability, you know. I love this one. This one's fantastic. I, I use this in my any of the black blues. If I have black blue, I put it in there. Because most people have at least a creature. Most people. I mean, it's not like guaranteed or anything. Great side card if you're actually going to be playing in a real tournament. But yeah, Burying Books is fantastic. They attack you. It can cost three. And then uh, if you're not, you can still remove it later on for five. I mean, it's this is, this is one of the better commons. Big play... Hunt for specimens. This one's actually not a bad card because it's a good blocker. It's cheap to put on the board, and it's still learn. You can lessen. You can get something back. Uh, humiliate. Necro fumes. Uh, Ghost forge. Or mythic foil. We have their angel. Dramatic finale. Adventurous, oh, that's probably the green one over there. Right. Then we have this, I have no idea. Probably exiling, I would assume. It's an enchantment, maybe. Maybe. And we have a foil blue one. Don't know. Oh, another foil, two green. And an elemental. It's a foil foreign art there. Alright, we got it. Pigment Storm. Resculpt. Campus. And Ingenious Golem. There's our lesson card that creates that token I was talking about earlier. And then we have our Elemental ex Expressionist. There we go. He always creates it too. All right. I don't have that yet. 
an arena. I really think they should actually put these cards, like a little code in here to unlock on arena. That'd be interesting. Like you can get a specific card, especially when you get to the mythic level and that kind of stuff. But I don't know. They probably don't want to do that because they'll probably lose money or not make money. I don't know. I think they should. I think they should do it. Alright. Don't know. I want the artwork though. Alright, another foreign foil. Probably a bolt, I assume. I'm not sure. And we got the Verhold Command. Fractal. Fuming Effigy, Masterpiece, Beaming, Teach, Spectre, Inkcaster, Legion Pulse, Start from Scratch, Elite Spellbind, Fire Dancer, our Elf Druid here, Red and One with a Cat. <laughs> Ah, Stone Rain. There we go. And then Adventurous Impulse. It's probably that green. No, it'll be the green one. And we have that one. And then an Elemental. Alright. Guiding Voice. Adept. Pop Quiz. Pop Quiz good. I love this one. This is a great one because the learn and the draw, so it's like two for one. Really good. I like it. It's so good. Because you get to pick what you're going to put in your uh, lessons. So, Campus Guide, Invocation, Wormhole Serpent, Apprentice, Academy. There it is again. Yeah, I mean, I should probably make a deck out of this. But I only have one. I need another one. At least. I think you need at least two to make that effective. Right. Then we have studies. All right. God willing. And a blue and two. Don't know. Regrowth. Oh, that one. <laughs> Appears to be a pretty good box, I think. I'm, I'm making an estimation right now. As far as square up, square up's not bad. You can turn a this. You can just turn a creature into a four four until end to turn. It actually comes out of nowhere, which is nice. I like it. I mean, he, he's good. It's a good spell. Or a turn. If you have nothing else to put in there, you can throw that in there. That's that's one of the lesson ones I throw in there if I can't throw anything else. <laughs> if I'm out. I've been playing with this one. Um, so th this one's actually interesting because you can exile it, put the counter on it, and then, uh, you know, there you go. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's interesting. I haven't really made it, like, super effective, but it is interesting. Like I said, I haven't played I haven't played Arena in a little bit, so okay, I'm gonna revitalize. I'm gonna foil, probably regrowth. I'm gonna guess regrowth. Probably wrong, but that's okay. <laughs> I'm only guessing regrowth because I just saw regrowth. <laughs> I don't even know if I showed this artwork very well. Go back to it. Alright, Dragon's Approach. Play with as many as you want. Cram, Ariel, Goth, Unwilling, and Ingredient, Emergent Sequence, Research. This is also a good one to go to since it's got the colorless. It goes in anything and it gets you the basic land. You know, and you can need some life. There's the foil. I think that one should be more worth more. Alright. 
That one, Poet's Quill. Mm, how about a Vampiric Tutor? That looks like a Vampiric Tutor. Probably, I don't know. <laughs> oh, I bet that's the two green and two. Harmonize, draw three. Draw, yeah. It's gotta be. Makes sense. Let's go over here. I'm probably screwing all that up. That's okay, I can fix all that. Uh, and then Selfless. I haven't played with this yet. So, yeah, that one's new to me. Alright, you there. Well, I think I mixed that all up. That's okay, we'll just keep going. Ah, we'll pretend I did that right. <laughs> just a floor thingy, you know. Alright. It doesn't matter, I just go through them anyway. Steady Break's good. It's a nice filler card. That one's a good one too. Mage Duel, Arch, Tunnel, Pest Summoning, Trample, Fox Guardian. I don't have him. So, yep, there we go. But now we do. We have him. Full art. Uh, oh, I bet it was Village Rights so I was seeing, maybe. Dark. Alright, well. Not as good as I was thinking. That's right. <laughs> Hoping for, anyways. Blue and two. Mm, you got nothing. Uh, claim the firstborn. Fantasticness. Um, and Hall of Oracles. There we go. I'll just put you there. I think that's where I was originally putting them, anyways. <laughs> Historian, fills me. Alright, hall, monitor. There we go. And then we have exponential growth. And then our fractal harness. Another one, elemental expression. Yeah, uh, expressionist. And a blue one. We haven't had this one yet. Got no idea. <laughs> brainstorm! I like brainstorm, that's good. And then green, unknown to me. Then we got Silver Silence. It's actually not a bad card. And then, all right. The last pack. I don't think I really did that good job of opening this one, but that's all right. Y'all will forgive, I'm sure. All right, first year. Guardian. Commons, Field Trip, Trudge, Helix, Summonin. Alright, we got our War Singer, Surge to Victory, Ingenious Mastery. Ooh, that one's a cool artwork too. Look at that. And the Dragon, now that one, that one's good. Don't know what it is, but it's a good artwork. Grape shot. That's probably the red one I saw earlier. Oh, we got this one already. Yeah. I remember you. Yeah, we got you already. Oh, that's probably Stone Rain right there. I'm estimating that's Stone Rain. And an elemental. All right. Okay, I'm going to total it up for you guys, and I'll be right back. All right, we didn't do too bad. We got $264.82. That means we beat the brats price because the box currently priced is about $223. So not too shabby. We got the channel, which was $50.73. That was insane. And the brainstorm alternate hard foil, uh, 27. So that's really, really interesting. All right. So hit the like button, subscribe, make a comment, and I'll talk to you again on the next one.